Panasonic kicked off proceedings of day one of IFA with a rather muted affair, announcing a string of photo imaging products and focusing on its link up with the 2012 Olympics. So it was down to Sony to properly excite. It finally launched its tablet range, the Sony Tablet P and Sony Tablet S, and it fired a warning shot at Apple on the iPad, saying, it's not who makes it first that counts, but who makes it better. Day two of the show is the busiest for press conferences, with the likes of Samsung, Toshiba, Sharp and LG all showing off new products and trying to vie for the attention of press and consumers alike. IFA is now in its 51st year, with 1,441 exhibitors all expected to turn up over the next few days, so be sure to check back to Tech Radar to get all the latest news.